Hello guys, welcome back to another video. And today I'm going to show you a tutorial because I had a struggle with this also. And actually this uh who solved this for me actually was my dad. He told me how to pretty much solve this problem. But anyways, what I'm going to show you today is how to record full screen games using Camtasia Studio. So as you can see right here, and the first thing you want to do, there's actually like two steps. You just want to open up Camtasia Studio Recorder. You want to go into Tools, Options, and you want to uh, check the box where it says Disable Arrow Theme Once Recording or something like that. What that will do is make it so when you record, after you finish recording, uh, your video won't be about at the quarter of your screen. It will be full screen. But yeah, so that's the first part. And the second part is made in game. Um, I think I haven't turned it off. I think I already turned it on yet, but I'm not so sure. I'm just gonna enter Black Ops right now. I'm not so sure if it's gonna be a black screen or you're gonna be able to see my screen because I forgot what settings I set it to. Because there's two different settings. The first setting that is the wrong one and the second setting that will make you able to record this. So I'm not so sure what you exactly see right now. Um, I think you may see the screen. I'm not sure though, but okay, yeah, I think you do see the screen. So I'm just gonna show you what to do. So at first, when you play a full screen game, the settings will probably be a default setting, and it won't be the settings I have right now. So what you want to do, pretty much, is you want to go into anywhere in your full screen game and just find the option setting. Once you go to option, you want to go into settings, and as you can see, there is the graphic settings or whatever settings. But what you want to change is the display mode. As you can see right now, I have windowed full screen. So what windowed full screen does is make you able to record it. I'm not so sure why exactly, but that's something. Anyways, if I turn it to full screen, and let me just apply it you'll see my screen will all turn black right about now or something like that it's all dark but my mouse is moving pretty smoothly um, yeah so this is also a problem when I record black ops that's why I'm probably not gonna make a gameplay of it that it's that my mouse is sometimes buggy when I record it on windowed full screen so pretty much I'm just gonna let you show my screen right now so you can see what's happening so right now it's it is at windowed full screen so there should be windowed full screen or just windowed right here and what's the difference between both of them is windowed you can switch the screen resolution while uh, windowed full screen you cannot it's just full screen so I'm not so sure why Camtasia Studio has this problem but you do have to record it with windowed full screen it's just I don't know it's probably a defect or maybe it's made like that I'm not sure at all anyways I think that's probably the end of the video so as I said before let's just recap the whole thing you first want to turn disable arrow while you're recording and the next thing is go in game go to your graphic settings and change the display mode to windowed full screen or just windowed it depends on how you're recording your video Anyways guys, I'm, let me just quit uh, Black Ops right now because it's a bit laggy. It's lagging my mouse. I can't see where it is. And that's what I really hate when I do this. Okay, now I'm just lost. Okay, where are you mouse? Okay, there. I found my mouse, finally. But yeah, okay, so yeah, there you go. So that's about it for this video. Um, sorry about what happened, like the bit lag. But that's the issue when I record with this. I don't know why. I don't know if other games were do the same. I'm not so sure. But yeah. Also, another notice is that thank you so much for half a million of views. Half a million is a bunch. Is a big, a big amount of people watching my videos. But I do have to say thanks to some people and also to one video. So first of all, I'm going to say thanks to TGN, the network that I'm part with because using the hashtag and stuff people can support me and make more views also I want to thank my subscribers and viewers for helping me view my videos to make it to half a million 
And finally, I want to thank my video. Uh, the one that has like 350,000 views. I can't believe it got that far. It's just a really, it's just really just a tutorial. I mean, I didn't expect it to get that far into views. But yeah. Anyways, guys, hope you enjoyed this video. And I'll see you later, guys. Remember, if you have any trouble with uh, recording these full screen videos, or if you just have trouble with anything, you can just leave a comment and I'll try to help you by making a video. And yeah, thanks so much for watching, guys, again. And I'll see you later. Bye.